On Thursday morning, I entered the latrines and I was doing some cleaning and I heard a commotion off to my side and I saw Fontanez um, helping his battle buddy who was in a mental health crisis and we stepped in and got him the help that he needed. He slept to the right of me, and I guess with uh, previous like events that happened, I kind of realized like you know maybe I should talk to him, help him out. Um, and um, we had the latrine, seeing what was going down, and I was just telling him like, "Come on, like let's like let's think about what you're about to do." And I seen him, I like lifted him up. So he wasn't, you know, so he could breathe and then till and clipped the PT belt and we just got him down and just stayed by him until, you know, he got help. If they're a normally social person and you see like a distinct change in their mood or the way they interact with the people around them, because I was across the bay and I would see him standing and moving around the bay, joking around, and then I would see him um, sitting back by the windowsill. And you can you can like see when he's up and when he's down. I would also mention um, sleeping. Sometimes if they're off, he won't sleep. There was there's been times that he he would be super tired, um, we're not eating right, and a couple battle buddies and I will realize that and know that he might be at that point. Um, on the first day, I didn't know if I wanted to keep it here with me because of my personal like relationships with people who have had problems with that. I didn't want a reminder. I like having it. I see it every day, I realize what Tone I did. Um, it kind of just brings me to the point where it's like, you know, he, he's still here with us. He's gonna help, he's okay. So it's just good to, to see it and, and know that He's still here. I think someone's going through something like that, just look out for the, you know. Support your battle buddies. Support, yeah, exactly. Just look out for one another. <laughs>